My name is Lakshmi Nair and I'm a PhD robotics student working with uh, Dr. Sonia Chernova. The broader goal of this research is to enable robots to inventively solve problems using parts available to them. And this is colloquially referred to as MacGyvering. Um, there's also a TV show that's based off of the same term. Specifically, this work looks at enabling robots to construct tools using parts available to them when the tools that they need for a task is either inaccessible or just unavailable to the robot. The robot here creates two different tools, a squeegee and a spatula. In order to reason about which parts to use for the construction of the tool, the robot looks at the shape of all the pieces available to it, as well as how the different pieces can be attached to construct a tool. Once it has the tool, it ranks the different possible part combinations to see which one works the best, and then goes ahead and constructs that. It also tests the tool to check if it works. This research was actually inspired by this amazing story that uh, took place on board the Apollo 13, uh, where the astronauts had to fashion a carbon dioxide filter using parts available to them uh, because the carbon dioxide levels were building up. Uh, this was a very stressful situation for the astronauts and uh, it took them several days to actually come up with a viable solution for constructing the carbon dioxide filter. So inspired by that scenario, we'd like robots to be able to assist humans in these situations by suggesting possible solutions. And since robots are often free uh, of the cognitive stress that humans encounter in these situations, they can come up with uh, interesting solutions that might work and make this very large computational space a lot more tractable. Currently, our research is able to enable robots to construct simple tools, but we want, as we move forward, we want them to be, be, uh, be able to construct more complicated structures, uh, the kind that humans often build. Um, uh, an interesting example of this would be the Rube Goldberg machines, uh, which involves reasoning about different aspects like physics and chemistry. And so, as we expand this research, we want robots to be able to reason about these different aspects to construct more complicated structures.